We know the DJ. We know the DJ. We know the DJ. <laughs> yeah. You yeah, know what I mean? talk to us about We Know the DJ. Yeah, We Know the DJ is just a multimedia blog that I started, um, I want to say, Thanksgiving, I want to say. And since then, like, it, it's grown. Like, we, we, we get, like, 50,000 hits per month, and we're just trying to, you know, show everyone who a DJ really is, like, in, in, this, in this entertainment business or even in the pop music business. There's not really too many artists that you can recognize a DJ with, you know what I mean? But with Bieber, you can. Like, people, I'm trying to, you know, show people that a DJ is needed in the music industry. Like, we are, we set trends, we set the music, um, you know, tempo. You know, we keep the, the move, we keep can, the, yeah. Yeah, the vibe of the show, we keep the energy there. And with Bieber, um, one thing that they allowed me to do with this uh, international tour is I became an a open and act for them. Congrats, so that's awesome. Throughout, like throughout awesome. Australia, um, London, even um, Asia, I, I opened up the show, did 20 minutes just to get the crowd going. You know what I mean? And that was a blessing. Like, you know what I mean? Just to be there. It's, I can't name too many people who've done that before. You know what I mean? So it's all part of the brand. We know the DJ.com. You know what I mean? This awareness of a DJ. You know what I mean? And one of the videos, I have to say, I was totally nerding out over your YouTube channel today, watching it for oh, we both a were. really long time with all our bosses. <laughs> um, but there was a video of you and Scooter, I, I don't know if you were shooting, but you were in Malaysia, and I think someone yelled out, like, we know the DJ. Yeah. And it was the middle of the day. The show hadn't even Random. started. Random. And they started going wild for you. Crazy. I mean, like, I don't even in understand Malaysia. it. Yeah, it's, and when I look at, like, uh, like my YouTube, I, I guess, uh, analytics or whatnot, mm -hmm. it it shows like where the popularity of the videos are. And I have a lot of popularity in overseas. And I guess that's because a lot of things people can't see, like physically see. So they look at YouTube for oh. whatever. And I have a lot of backstage, you know You've I mean, got stuff. the inside Behind scoop. Yeah, I mean, well, I just try to. Like a lot of, <laughs> you might even see like the deleted scenes uh, episodes I have and just be clips from when he was 15. 14 to like now, you know what I mean? Like I have so much, <laughs> I got so much. Do you have more that you're gonna share? <laughs> no, I mean, no, I, a, lot, a lot of it, like a lot of a lot of the things are, uh, are you, I think I've put up already and and you'll see a lot more in this next coming season. I can't really reveal put out my, re reveal of season four, but. You've got you know it I mean? down, I just, man. I just have some stuff in the works, you'll see. But something that hope maybe we'll get to see is that you said you just came from, from the recording studio where Justin is doing the Christmas album. We know he's also going to be working on when another album. Um, are you guys collaborating at all? Or oh, does I'm, he ask for your opinion? Or? I'm, I'm more of a good friend. Like, I just, mm -hmm. I, you know, I just like listening to new music. And yeah. He really doesn't need my opinion, I, I feel like, because everything I'm hearing is great. I mean, that's, you know, that's, you know, his team is good. You know, Scooter, Scooter's really on it. You know I mean? That's all I can really say. Congrats, you know, that's the guy. I love that support. You know, I try to, I'm just happy to be in the studio. You know <laughs> yeah, right? Exactly. With Bieber, you know, I'm just happy to be in the studio with him, honestly. Well, there's definitely something we can ask your opinion on, I though. know, we need your help. Because you're the expert. <laughs> DJ Tay James, you gotta tell us, what are the three top songs? If we're downloading some new tunes, maybe back to school, hmm. Getting ready for fall, homecoming dance, yeah. that kind of stuff. Right now, definitely is. What's hot? Party rock, LMFAO. Yeah! Shuffling. Do you want to shuffle later? I, I'm at the shuffle bot. I feel like if I shuffle, I might hurt my ankle or something. I'm joking. We can Come shuffle. Come on! We Dude, I met the <laughs> shuffle bot this weekend, and I was really excited. You know the gold robot, shuffle bot? No. He's in the music video. Ah. Uh, Killer. I got you. The robot. Yeah. <laughs> Love him. Yeah. OK, so we got, we got that, that one. one. Um. Nicki Minaj got a hot song with Rihanna called Fly, I believe it's called. Oh yeah, yeah. The, the music video just yeah. debuted at the VMAs over the weekend. That's a very hot song. I feel like it's gonna do well. Mm -hmm. um, and Drake, uh, I'm on one. That's pretty good. Well, that's DJ Khaled. That's okay. that's a hot song too. So those three songs, I try to keep it, you know, mixed up. Yeah, you bit. totally <laughs> mixed it up a little bit. Also, I'm curious mm. since you are a music. Oh, sorry, oh. do you have someone else? Oh, to add? oh, mm. there's an afterthought here. Bonus track. Yeah. Hmm. What's the wild card? I don't know, I'm Tay, really what's liking. The wild card? <laughs> You're funny. Okay. <laughs> Man, I'm, I'll, I'll keep those mixed. I was trying to think. I like, I really like Afrojack's new song, um, Take Control, or Dirty Talk by Winter Gordon. It's a couple different, you know, top 40, you know, international music I've been listening to recently. Oh, cool. Just to keep my, my you know, my horizons open. I just, I just try to listen to everything. You know what I mean? This, this is not just listen to hip hop and R&B, but country, you know, 
keep it all. Taylor Swift got some new music. I know she's working on it. Sounds great. Yeah. You know what I mean? So I just, I just, you know, that's why I've been hearing. So. Well, we hear, we heard rumors of a Bieber Taylor Swift collaboration. We have our fingers crossed. Yeah. I mean, I we haven't have heard, crossed. but if I do hear, it would sound great. <laughs> 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 you know what I mean? That sounds like a great, you know, combo right there. You're awesome. definitely on the cutting edge of music. So aside from those two um, groups that you referenced. Who else should we really be keeping our ears open to? Like, who's getting mm -hmm. ready to break out in the music world that we should get familiar with before? Mm -hmm. So we're super cool. Thank you. All right. Well, artist <laughs> I know is a uh, is an artist out of DC named Blake Kelly. Okay. Up and coming rapper. He's pretty good. Um, he has a lot of he has a, like a little bit of a following that's that's building up. But he's got a lot of hits on YouTube. I know. So he's doing well. And um, another artist. Um, let me see. Is an artist that's signed to, I don't know if he's signed to Interscope or Universal, but he has a song produced by Dark Child, Lil Play, um, oh, called yeah. Birthday Dress, okay. which is a, I feel is gonna be an absolute smash. Like I heard it like last weekend and I cannot stop playing it. And then- so the group is called, what's No, it's, it's one it guy, it's a rapper, his name Lil Play. He was but, here, he's yeah. been here. Before. He's been here? Oh, he yeah. talked to Bridget. Yeah, yeah he has a song Our called music girl. Birthday Dress, and it's a banger, like. He is so his music is so catchy. It's so it's like absolutely it. like it's like a mixture of like urban hip hop and like top forty. It's Very like unique. it's like a rapper rapping over Justin Timberlake beats or rapping over like, you know, Bieber songs, for example. It's like oh, it's cool. it's pretty cool. I like Huge it. Audience it's like it's like yeah, it's totally. it's open for him. So I was, I'm happy to hear more from him, but yeah, like that's that's why I've been listening to. J. Cole is another good friend of mine. He's doing good too. His mm -hmm. album's about to come out. He has a song called Workout that's pretty well. So, wow, we've got a whole party so list of downloads to download. we need to take care of. I'm ASAP. sorry, maybe I should write down a list or something. Please. Yes, <laughs> I think we should take notes. We'll have to play this back and take notes. <laughs> so you have a, like a crazy schedule coming up. What are you most looking forward to? Uh, it's international tours coming up at the end of the end of the month. I have some Labor Day weekend plans, some DJing coming up. Uh, what else? I'm also teaching, tutoring, tutoring um, whoever wants to learn how to DJ. I have a, a, a girl, a young DJ right now well, that I taught. She's in Atlanta, her name's Lucy. Um, I flew out to Atlanta and I taught her uh, the basics of DJing. And right now she's uh, doing her thing. She's practicing pretty hard. So awesome. um, I just like mentoring whoever wants to learn the craft. You know what I mean? That's what I'm here for. That's Good amazing. for you. That's really cool. Give back to the community. Yeah, I like that. Well, thank you so much thank for you. joining us today. This was lots of fun. You're a cool dude. I'll try to be like you. You're a cool dude. No, 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 no. Look at this no. gentleman. Oh, oh, all three of us. And that's all we do it on Clever TV. <laughs> DJ Tay James. You have a DJ.com. Jocelyn Davis and I'm Jane Ward. Thanks so much for checking out Clever TV. We'll see you guys next time. Bye. Thank you. Now we're going to go shuffle. Oh. Every day I'm shuffling. <laughs>